Whale sharks inhabit warm waters around the world. They are found in the western Atlantic Ocean from the coast of New York in the United States to central Brazil, including the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean Sea. In the eastern Atlantic, they occur from the coasts of Senegal, Mauritania, and Cape Verde to the Gulf of Guinea. Whale sharks also inhabit the Indian Ocean and the western and central Pacific. They have appeared off the coast of South Africa and in the Red Sea, as well as near Pakistan, India, Sri Lanka, Malaysia, Thailand, China, Japan, the Philippines, Indonesia, Papua New Guinea, Australia, New Caledonia, and Hawaii. In the Eastern Pacific, they can be found from Southern California in the United States to Northern Chile. Body Structure The whale shark is enormous and reportedly capable of reaching a maximum length of about 18 meters. Most specimens that have been studied, however, weighed about 15 tons and averaged about 12 meters in length. The body coloration is distinctive. Light vertical and horizontal stripes form a checkerboard pattern on a dark background, and light spots mark the fins and dark areas of the body. The head is broad and flat, with a somewhat truncated snout and an immense mouth. Several prominent ridges of hard tissue, often called keels, extend horizontally along each side of the body to the tail. There are five large gill slits on each side of the head region, just above the pectoral fins. The special spongy tissue inside the gill slits that are supported by the shark's gill arches, forms a unique filter used in feeding. A short, rudimentary sensory organ called a barbel hangs from each nostril. The shark has a large front dorsal fin and smaller rear dorsal and anal fins. Whale shark reproduction, babies, and lifespan. Not much is known about these sharks' reproduction, as these big fish can be evasive, if they don't wish to be seen. Their mating behavior is uncertain, as it is unlikely to be witnessed, and, therefore, not well documented. However, scientists do know that these sharks must be 25 to 30 years old, before they are ready to breed. Once the sharks have mated, the mother shark retains the fertilized eggs inside of her, so that the baby shark eggs have a safe place to develop. They will remain inside the mother until they hatch, at which time the baby sharks are born alive and fully formed and ready to take care of themselves. For this reason, the mother does not take care of the babies once they are born. Litter size is uncertain, but a litter of 300 whale shark babies has been documented. The babies are about 21 to 25 inches long at birth. Whale shark lifespan is not clearly known, but it is estimated around 70 years and scientists have determined that these big fish can live for over 100 years, possibly as long as 125 years. Whale shark population. No accurate counts of the worldwide whale shark population exist, but their numbers appear to be decreasing significantly in parts of the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. Many countries have banned or regulated the hunting of whale sharks, but such activities still occur in various parts of the world. In China, hundreds of these fish are illegally killed each year, at least partly for their fins which are prized for their supposed medicinal qualities. The oil is also collected to be used in food and medicine, and the meat is used either fresh or salted as a food source for some people. Some estimates show a decline of about 75% of the whale shark population in certain parts of the Pacific Ocean. Whale shark predators and threats. Other shark species are actually some of the top whale shark predators, as well as other large oceanic predators. Great white sharks, tiger sharks, and orcas, all prey upon younger smaller sharks, but, for the most part, such predators don't prey on larger whale sharks, because they're just too big for predators to challenge. Another threat to the continued existence of these sharks is humans. In some cases, humans kill them by accidentally catching them in fishing nets, where they usually end up dying. These huge fish are also still hunted in some countries such as India, the Philippines, and China, where they are used for food, oil, and their fins. Interactions with humans. Whale sharks do not pose a danger to humans. Many individual whale sharks have been approached, examined, and even ridden by divers, without showing any sign of aggression. They may, out of curiosity, approach and examine people in the water. Whale sharks have occasionally bumped sport fishing boats, but this is most likely a reaction to the bait being dangled by the anglers above. These sharks are sometimes struck by boats as they swim at or near the surface. Whale sharks are of little interest in commercial fishing. However, they have been caught accidentally as bikage in some areas, and they have been caught for food in Pakistan, India, Taiwan, the Philippines, and China, where they are eaten fresh or dried and salted. 10 Incredible Whale Shark Facts First one, the largest recorded whale shark was the length of a bowling alley. A regulation bowling alley is 60 feet long. The largest recorded whale shark came in at 61.7 feet. Can you imagine a giant shark in the lane next to yours? While most whale sharks are not that long, the average ones are still around 40 feet. 
Next time you pass a school bus you can compare that to the length of a whale shark. The second one, big but slow. Whale sharks swim about 3 miles per hour. You may be familiar with a tortoise and the hare, but what if a tortoise raced a whale shark? Well, the whale shark would most likely win, unless he got very distracted. Whale sharks are still slow swimmers compared to most sharks, and at 3 miles per hour they would just beat a tortoise whose top speed is 0.63 miles per hour. Third one, can you ship a shark by UPS? Yes, in 2006, two whale sharks were shipped by UPS from Taiwan to Atlanta's Georgia Aquarium. The two female whale sharks were around 13 feet long each, and had to be transported, in special containers to mimic the conditions of the ocean. A team of vets from the aquarium watched over the sharks on the flight to take care of them, and make sure the transition went smooth. In 2007 two more whale sharks, this time two males, were flown over in a similar fashion with no issues. Fourth one, twins, triplets, quads or 300 babies. The reproductive habits of whale sharks are still being studied, but there is a confirmed case of a pregnant whale shark that was caught near Taiwan in 1995. Upon examination, scientists found 300 pups. Whale sharks are similar to other sharks, in that they are ovoviparous, their eggs are fertilized internally, then they hatch inside the female, and then are delivered by live birth. Scientists speculate that the live babies are released over a long period of time versus all at once. The fifth one, whale sharks have the largest eggs, twice as big as an ostrich egg. Ostriches produce the largest eggs for land animals, their eggs can reach 6 inches long by 5 inches wide. Whale shark eggs are about twice that big. The eggs remain inside the female during growth and hatch inside the female, but there has been evidence of whale shark eggs being found. One found in the Gulf of Mexico was 12 inches long, and 5 one half inches wide. The sixth one, big shark but tiny teeth, lots of them, over 3,000. Whale sharks have row after row after row of tiny little teeth, 300 rows on average. The teeth are about the size of the tip of a pencil. But because whale sharks are filter feeders, sifting the nutrients from the water, they don't use their teeth at all for eating. Scientists are not sure of their purpose. The seventh one, whale shark's mouth can be 4 feet wide. Talk about a funnel, the whale shark's mouth can be 4, or more feet wide, but their throat is only the size of a quarter. So no need to worry about getting swallowed up by that gaping mouth. Whale sharks swim slowly with their large mouth open, sifting through the water for plankton, small shrimp and small fish. Their gills act as a suction, to draw the food in. It is amazing how an animal, that weighs 41,000 lbs can support itself on the simple diet. 8-1, happy 100th birthday. Whale sharks are believed to have a lifespan similar to humans, ranging from 70, 100 years, but some believe they could live even longer. Marine biologists are trying to study how long whale sharks can survive in captivity. Alice, who was one of the whale sharks brought to the Georgia Aquarium, recently died alive there for more than 15 years. Some people are against keeping whale sharks in captivity, because they can't mimic their natural habitat, while others believe it is an important piece in educating humans about the sharks, in order to protect them from extinction. The ninth one, just keep swimming. The longest migration recorded for a whale shark was a 12,000-mile trip. If you fly from New York to LA it is about 2,800 miles. A group of scientists tagged a whale in the Pacific Ocean near Panama, and recorded its travels all the way to the Philippines. That is like going from New York to Lyme back, twice. This shark's trip was spread out over 841 days, which averages 14.3 miles day. One scientist, Eric Hofmeyer, wanted to study the typical migratory habits of the whale shark. His team tagged 42 sharks in the Gulf of Mexico, and tracked their movements by satellite for a year. They were able to plot their movements, and see where and when they traveled. In this study, it was interesting to find, that none of the sharks, left the Gulf of Mexico. The most common place for them to hang out was an area near the coast of Louisiana. The tenth one, whale sharks can swim a mile deep. They clearly have an unfair advantage at Marco Polo. The current record for the deepest dive by a fish, is held by a whale shark at 1.20 miles. Think about a track with an outside lane of water. That whale shark swam around the equivalent of four times, but straight down. So, today we are looking for some details about whale sharks. Thanks for watching, subscribe for more videos.